The Disaster Medical Support Unit, or DMSU, is a complex, well-organized system that can be developed as separate modules or used as a multi-system unit to support a large-scale event. The equipment and supplies are stored in a temperature control trailer that can be positioned at a pre-planned event or brought to a mass casualty incident scene to provide additional equipment and supplies. In the Hampton Roads region, all 11 of the DMSUs can be requested by a participating jurisdiction as a mutual aid request for additional resources. The unit is designed to support the following tasks. Patient evacuation to a casualty collection point or treatment area. Triage with patient treatment in preparation for transport. Personal protective equipment or PPE. Support decontamination of patients. Rehabilitation or rehab of team members. Morgue logistics equipment and evidence preservation supplies, provides equipment to establish the medical branch of the Incident Command Organization. Here are some important details for each of those tasks. Patient evacuation. Several pieces of equipment can be used to assist with patient evacuation. The DMSU is supplied with backboards, raven litters, and patient movers to facilitate the movement of multiple patients. Triage and treatment. There is a triage module with all of the components needed for several team members to complete the initial triage of multiple patients. Each DMSU can set up two red, two yellow, two green treatment areas along with a temporary morgue for expired patients. The treatment areas have colored tarps and traffic cones to provide a funnel in and out of the area for patient movement. Each treatment area is supplied with a color-coded master treatment box which contains oxygen, IV, airway, patient assessment, and bulk bandage modules. Each module has the equipment and supplies needed by personnel that will be providing emergency treatment for patients. One significant part of the treatment capability is to provide oxygen for multiple patients. Each DMSU has two M oxygen cylinders that can be located in the treatment area. The cylinder is connected to a regulator, long oxygen hose, a Y connector, short oxygen hose, and many later. This layout will provide multiple patients with either 6 or 15 liters per minute of oxygen. Additionally, there are two pediatric modules that have a completely stocked Braslow bag that can be placed in any treatment area for pediatric treatment. It is estimated that the DMSU will be able to treat between 150 and 200 patients. However, the total patient care capability of the DMSU will vary based on the type of incident, severity of injuries, and number of emergency services personnel available to provide care. Personal Protective Equipment The DMSU has 10 Class 3 ensembles of protective equipment for response personnel and 108 Class 4 suits. Class 3 ensembles are used in incidents involving low levels of vapor or liquid chemical hazards where concentrations are below levels immediately dangerous to life or health. Class 4 ensembles are for use in terrorism incidents involving biological or radiological particulate hazards only where the concentrations are below levels immediately dangerous to life or health. This ensemble can also be worn to provide body substance isolation. Decontamination The DMSU has multiple decontamination assets, including five Raven stretchers, which move non-ambulatory patients through a decontamination process, and several modules that contain youth and adult pre- and post-decon kits for each patient. Responder Rehabilitation the DMSU provides most of the recommended equipment identified in NFPA 1584 to accomplish the function of rehab services. Rehab can be set up in a very simple fashion to allow for hydration and medical monitoring in accordance with regional protocols. Rehab forms should be completed for each member prior to returning to service. Rehab can also be set up with a full complement of equipment and supplies that allows for both passive and active cooling of team members. The rehab module contains core cooler rehab chair that provides intercooling, misting fan, supplies and equipment for rehydration, easy up tent with side panels and trailer awning for shade and wind protection, tripod lighting and generator for air conditioning unit and additional electrical needs, morgue logistics equipment and evidence preservation supplies. The DMSU provides morgue logistics equipment that aids the morgue manager in setting up and operating a temporary morgue including checklists, several sizes of body bags, and paperwork needed for evidence preservation, biohazard identification, and remains tracking. Incident Command 
The incident command module on the DMSU contains the equipment and supplies needed to set up the medical branch of the incident command organization. This module has position-specific vests, checklists, and duties and responsibilities paperwork required for each position to support a mass casualty incident. The 11 disaster medical support units are positioned throughout the Hampton Roads region to provide standardized supplies and equipment for emergency services personnel to use when large complex incidents overwhelm daily use resources. Each of the 11 disaster medical support units are organized exactly the same to provide familiarity and promote ease of use across the region. Standardized equipment, supplies, and packaging assist incident commanders determine the number of DMSUs that would be needed to support an incident. In accepting this resource as a donation from the Hampton Roads Metropolitan Medical Response System, each jurisdiction agreed to maintain the DMSU and make it available to mutual aid requests throughout the Hampton Roads region. Should you have any questions about the Hampton Roads MMRS program or interest in serving as a member of the Metropolitan Medical Strike Team, please contact us at 757-963-0632 or email hrmmrs at vaems.org. For additional information, please visit our website at www.hrmmrs.org.